What's up everyone? Today I'm going to be reviewing a live. And if you know me, you know that I love kombucha. And this isn't necessarily a kombucha, it's an ancient mushroom elixir. Let me just read you the description. Nature's defense. Alive is nature's answer to protecting and preserving your body's vitality. Using the fruiting body of three powerful adaptogenic mushrooms, we craft this antioxidant-rich offering to defend your body against free radicals and the harmful effects of oxidative stress. Our nutrient-dense elixir creates a natural force field that helps slow aging, reduce cellular degradation, and maximize physical recovery. And there are three mushrooms in here. There's the reishi, the chaga, and the turkey tail. I've actually uh, had a little bit of uh, chaga before. Motorcycle going by up there. Um, I, I bought this um, tincture and I bought it from Spore and Sprout and I just put it inside of my, uh, inside of my bucha daily. And yeah, it was actually really nice but I wanted to try out some uh, mushroom drinks. I was in Whole Foods and I just walked past these and I was like, holy crap, they have uh, mushroom drinks. And they're pretty low on sugar. Um, that's like one of the biggest reasons that I picked up. I was looking for an alternative to soda. Um, I just feel like soda is not a great thing to put in your body. The caffeine, the sugar, um, soda is just, horrible for your body. Anyways, each one of these bottles only has 12 grams of sugar. Let me make sure. Okay, maybe this one has a little bit more. This one has 16 grams of sugar. This one has 12 grams of sugar. 12 grams of sugar. So it looks like the root beer one has a little bit more sugar in it. Um, but yeah, lower than a normal soda, right? Let's try it out. Maybe I'll mix them up. Let me mix them up. From here to here. First one, the Casacara Cider. Not really a description on what the flavor is. Um, cool message, let thy food be thy medicine. Okay, let's just pop it open and give it a try. I like that they're in these glass bottles. Um, with Bucha, what happens is if you ever, if you're you know, want to try bucha, try to get the ones in these brown bottles because the, what are those called? Probiotics. The probiotics, once they, once the light hits the probiotics, it will actually kill the probiotics. So, um, it's better to have the bucha inside of these brown bottles. And I feel like, um, maybe that helps preserve something in here from the light as well. Okay, let's pop it open. Bottles recyclable, caps recyclable, recyclable, cheers. Ooh. That's different. I didn't know what I was really expecting with that one. Cider. It does have like a, almost like a, a pumpkin spice, apple, cider, a little bit of all of that right in there, yeah. I like it. This is more of like a fall kind of drink and you, you can see it's fall out here so it really, really fits the, the season. Okay. Okay, let's see what else we got here. Root beer. Wouldn't it be funny to do like a a root beer float with mush it has like mushrooms inside of it too? Yeah. It has like a really strong root beer smell to it. Yeah. A little bit different than what you'd expect with A and W, but I really like it. It has more of like a uh, a natural kind of taste to it than just sugar. 
what are the ingredients in here? Ingredients are adaptogenic mushroom in, infusion. Okay, so that means the reishi, um, the chaga, the turkey tail. It has some tea in it, raw apple cider vinegar, dark amber maple, root beer spices, and 100% pure love. Organically produced. Wow. I'm liking it. I think maybe I found my new thing. So, last we have the matcha vanilla. Hmm. That's funny. Usually at Pete's um, in the morning, I'll go to Pete's and I will get a uh, just a matcha. And you can really, yeah, you can taste that matcha flavor and a little bit of like a hint of vanilla. They kind of all have like this kind of like naturally taste to them, like really earthy. Yeah, what a great alternative to soda, to sugar water pumped with uh, depression. <laughs> I highly recommend them. I highly recommend uh, trying kombucha. If you've never tried kombucha either, highly recommend just going out and trying some kombucha because it is amazing. Some of them are higher in sugar than others, but um, you can you can like look around and see what one uh, has you know lower sugar. Maybe I'll do a review in the future about kombucha. But um, you know, if you're ever in Whole Foods, I recommend trying these out. Um, I think out of all of these, the root beer one is good, but I don't know if that would be like my go-to. I feel like this was what I, I'd probably just make a root beer float with that. But for like, if I was in the store and I just wanted to pick one of these up to drink, I think I would go with the, the Kasakara Cider. It just has like a really good, like, pumpkin-y, spicy, cidery, fall, natural kind of taste to it. I dig it. Thumbs up.